Hey, this is David Adams again with another tutorial brought to you by DNADesignStudios.net. We are going to do a tutorial on uh, how to animate a helicopter, um, the propellers and the body. I don't claim to be the best artist, but uh, you'll get the idea. I built this helicopter a few minutes ago, so we'll see if, uh, uh, you know, you go ahead and build something you want to uses the rig and uh, I'll show you how to animate it in this uh, tutorial so without any further ado let's get started open up Maya and we'll close this out and as you can see I, I built a helicopter it's not the greatest uh, by any means but it'll serve its purpose. It's got uh, all the things that you need uh, for a good helicopter. But uh, let's just go ahead and get started here. We'll uh, select this top rotor. I actually made three layers. I made the body, the front blade, and the back blade as three separate layers. And uh, part of the body are these skids. Um, I don't know what the technical term is the landing gear and uh, uh, we got the body here which is probably one of the worst drawings I've ever made but uh, that's not the point of this tutorial this tutorial is to show you how to animate um, so as you can see we've got this uh, set at 24 frames uh, we're gonna change that to uh, instead of 24 we're going to change it to 300 frames and we're going to have it start on one and end on 300 so now we got a pretty good timeline to work with here so go ahead and select your top blade or your first uh, object and what we want to do is we want to see which axis we're on. Uh, if you were a professional animator you'd already know but I'm not. I'm just a guy at home trying to be cool. Um, so anyway uh, you can uh, see that we're rotating on the Y axis here so what we want to do is we want to uh, go to frame one actually yeah let's go to frame one and we're gonna go key selected now we have a key selected on frame one on the rotate Y axis and we're gonna go to frame 300 and we're gonna rotate it a bunch of times hopefully I'm getting this right like I said, I never claim to be the best at this software, but hey. Okay, so we've rotated it, looks like, a, a 3,187 units here. And we're going to select a key here, too. So let's just go back through time. Oh, yeah. Check that out. Now our, ro our propeller is rotating and that is pretty awesome um, in my opinion um, but let's go ahead and go to the rear uh, propeller here okay so I I had to redo the entire back propeller because I had one of my uh, things off but now uh, what you want to do is you want to uh, select your back propeller key selected go to frame 300 irritate it about a few times and key selected now you can see our blade is spinning. Not that great, but it's spinning. Now what we can do is 
is animate the entire thing if we want to. We can select all of our objects go to the beginning of the timeline press put an S right there or a quick S go to 60 frames out bring the whole object up hit S again what we will do is we'll just make this whole helicopter just fly away and we'll just make this helicopter just fly away and we'll let Hit S again. So So thank you for viewing this tutorial. Uh, uh, this is David Adams from DNA Design Studio saying goodbye.